Hello, I'm Ethan from EWCRM. This is the first video in my Tech Stack Spotlight series where we're gonna discuss the complete full digital marketing roadmap. All these different softwares that you need to put together and help you get through the static of all the other softwares trying to sell to you. I've been doing CRM nerd work for almost 10 years. I've done thousands of automations. I've built out 750 CRMs on dozens of platforms. I'm very confident and knowledgeable in this space, so let's dive in. Starting out your process, you're gonna to wanna to have a landing page. So we're gonna have that on a, maybe a contact us on a website or a landing page that we're gonna to send to a list of people that we got from a trade show or a call to action. However, we're gonna drive that traffic. We're gonna start the process out. You've really got three options. I show two here, JotForm and Gravity Forms. There also is onboard forms inside of the CRM that are small upcharges on both of my favorites here, High Level and Pipedrive. So you've got a basic form. Here on the left is a basic pipe drive form, basic name, email, how can I help you? When you get your form too complicated and you need things like on the left, like a multi, this is a tour company, one of my clients, they have the option of a multi-day tour or a one-day tour, which triggers other fields to be shown or not shown. When you do things that are more complicated like that, you need to involve the more powerful form builder outside of the CRM. Now you can involve Gravity Forms or you can use JotForm. If your website is built on uh, WordPress, a lot of times Gravity Form is a really easy tool to integrate. It's pretty affordable, but it does again have basic rules. If you want anything complex like here on the right, you just simply have to go with JotForm. To connect the dots on that, so we've got our landing page, we drove our traffic, we fired out an email to 2,500 people, and we sent, he, he, click here for more information, or we did a Facebook ad, or any way we click here for more info, got the landing page completed. This arrow here is where Zapier or Make.com comes in, and I have videos in this entire series where I cover the difference between the two and which one is best, but you need one. You may say, well, Ethan, JotForm has a, a direct integration with Pipedrive built in in its integration marketplace. Yeah, but the same thing goes for the forms being too complicated. Sometimes the fields in the CRM are too complicated. And not to get too geeky, a lot of times you just need the $9 a month make.com plan and call it a day. So I prefer Make over Z uh, Zapier, and I go into a video of details of why, but it's required to integrate the other apps into your CRM, your quarterback on your team. It's 70% cheaper than Zapier, and it's much, much faster. So it's really a no-brainer. Again, go to my website, EWCRM, take a look at that five-minute long video on the difference between the two. It'll sink in a little deeper. So once our, our lead, I got a new lead in. I got Tony Stark from Stark Industries came in on my lead generation form. He hit my landing page. I fired out a thousand emails to a bunch of previous clients and tried to bring in some new business. I automatically created them in my, in my pipe drive with that Zapier connection. And I've got a workflow inside of pipe drive. Whenever I have a lead in the stage of nurture the client, they're gonna get five emails over the course of five weeks. So that automatically all took place within one millisecond of Tony hitting submit on the website. Next up, I may want to text message Tony. Maybe I'm in real estate and I want to send a drone video of a new house that I put on the market. That's called a multimedia message, a video inside of an SMS. Any of those things, if you want to do a uh, SMS or an MMS, you want to use Just Call. That's my go-to. I happen to really like Just Call's AI agent. That's what I'm using for my business. So if you want to give a try out to my uh, Lucas, he's my AI agent. He's at 386. 766-4949, go ahead and give a call and try it out. But that, in addition to having great phone service, they also have awesome text messaging and there's some SMS, there's a lot you can build into here. Again, I've got an entire training series on Just Call. I'm a big fan of it. I've been with this company as far as loyalty for 10 years and watched them grow to be just an incredible provider. Next up, you may want to data enrich. So I like Apollo.io. There's others out there like Seamless AI. What is data enrichment? Easy way to say it, it's doing a digital background check on somebody. It's maybe taking a business and saying, when Tony Stark comes into my website with those Stark Industries, get me more information and feed it back to my CRM. Let Pipedrive know maybe how many employees are in the company, maybe what the company's financials are, the locations, maybe a direct phone number for Tony. You can harvest and enrich a lot. This company is doing big things at Apollo.io and 
um, you could take a look at them. Again, any of these softwares that I mentioned, there's some discount links. Some of them I have some discounts for, some of them I have a free month, some have extended trials. They're all in the YouTube channel or they're on my website, EWCRM. Give it a try. Next up, property radar. If you are in any type of a business involving somebody's address, Property Radar is an automation that is amazing. Again, I have a video on this, but simply put, what if Tony Stark uh, was looking for, um, I, my business was I do um, backyard patios. I do decks, I do barbecues, I do renovations in someone's backyard, I do landscaping and gardening. What if I used an automation that triggered whenever anybody in Atlantic City, New Jersey uh, took out a home equity line of credit? I could automatically feed that person into my pipe drive and automatically know that they just got a fresh HELOC on their public record and I can go and knock on that door and offer my services and build them a wonderful barbecue. On the other side of it, what if I got my address from Tony Stark and I searched his address to get more information about his house to pre-qualify him? What if I didn't want to qualify Tony if he didn't live in a house that wasn't worth at least $200,000? I could do that. Property Radar is phenomenal, phenomenal stuff. Next up, I'm going to eventually want to send out a quote or a contract or maybe an NDA. There's a lot of different things that we could put in here that we could build out. So there's some templates. There's um, uh, You can import a PDF, but PandaDoc is your go-to. PandaDoc's going to take that like the quarterback's going to give the ball to Panda Doc and say, complete this HVAC proposal uh, template. It's going to complete in Tony Stark's name, Tony Stark's company, his contact information. I'm going to see full reporting inside of my CRM. I'm going to see when that contract is read. I'm going to see when it's signed. So full reporting back. So starting the process, the landing page, sent to the CRM, to the quarterback. The quarterback sends out marketing text messages. The quarterback may send out uh, information to Apollo to say, hey, let me get more information about my lead. When it comes time to send out a contract or perhaps an NDA at the start of the process, automatically sent, and when they sign it, all reported back to our quarterback on our team. And finally, QuickBooks, get paid, send invoices. Again, there's videos on all of these. So if you want any links to any of these softwares, go take a look. There's some trials on my website. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel and continue watching these videos in the series to get this full digital marketing picture and more about this roadmap.